Okay, this is the Yukon's solo stove. It's the biggest one they have. And I just got it. Looks very elegant. And we set this up. There used to be a hot tub here. So we put down stone here on top of the cement slab and put some pavers here. And they say you can, um, they say you can put it directly on the deck. I just didn't want to do that. And since I had the hot tub here, it was just a convenient situation. But, um, yeah, I mean, it's still decently hot underneath. It's extremely hot. And, um, I actually put a wet log on there as a test. I wanted to see once it got burning, though I had a, I had a piece of firewood that was, um, not seasoned. It was like relatively, maybe like two weeks old that uh, the tree had been cut down. And the fire just, it just immediately consumes. It really is a real thing with the airflow that creates uh, a more robust flame. Yes, do you like the fire pit? I need one. <laughs> My daughter likes it, so it's just an elegant thing. I mean, at the end of the day, it's a tin can that you put in your yard or wherever, but it's very elegant looking. And, um, you know, comparable fire pits are, you know, the same price. So this is just a cool, elegant looking fire pit, and it's got the holes on the bottom, and that really is a key, key factor in just making it... Uh, burn really effectively so that's it that's my review i am very happy with the purchase